Howdy folks, Tom Bartley here once again in Las Vegas, Nevada. So, you'll notice a few additions here. Let's just go through the additions first, and then it'll fly past. But basically, I've added code for arrays. Um, both arrays as globals, and arrays within functions, and um, test code around that, uh, constants within functions, uh, that kind of stuff, basically. So. Just adding another level of uh, interest here. Uh, so this local radius, it's incremented thanks to radius, takes it through there. So just making sure that this stuff is working as anticipated. A floating point and double math is going to be next. I think that's the main outstanding piece for my friend Mike's use. Um, anyway, so that's the arrays added. I've added go. Which actually compiles through and shows it. Show go. Um, I've added, what else have I added here? I think that's it, basically. I'll, well, Java, JavaScript, Python, and Swift all have the array code, and it's all pre generated. So let's just run a test to start off with. Um, well, I've got to get into the right tree first. CD, BBC, Zaha. Okay, let's run test to start off with. There we go. Go through all of that and let's run build. And hopefully I think this will build the array code. Yep, I think that fixed the array code. So we've got all these new files for the array code. Um, let's just show these for the sake of showing it. It also runs tests on them to make sure that they actually output. But here we have the uh, Python doing local radius code, incrementing it, the Java similarly. JavaScript accordingly. So that's where we are today. Tim Bodley in Las Vegas, Nevada, signing out.